What is going on, Ben Nation? I hope you're having a great morning. My name is Bleeves. Uh, let's talk price action. Let's talk news. Let's talk what's going on. First of all, you can, by the end of this month, do a recovery for your SIM swap attack. They're going to open that up for everybody to be made whole. Uh, that'll be closed probably about a month, two months later. So be watching out for that. Make sure if you're not already, be in the Telegram. If you like this type of content, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, the bell to be notified. Now we're gonna try to keep this one very simple today uh, because there's not a lot going on. There is, but uh, most of it we can't talk about, but I'll kind of show it to you uh, in order to make a reference so that you can check it out. And then you'll have at least kind of an idea uh, of some of the, the, uh, stuff, if you will, that's going on. First off, uh, let's talk price action. So as you can see right now, we are successfully trending through this channel. Now, uh, I, I've put a couple of brackets here. You can see we're minting lower, high, uh, higher lows on the bottom up here and higher tops each time we come out uh, for a retest. Now, this is one, two, three. Uh, maybe we get five, maybe we get four, but it would look something like this. Moving this up into the 1415 range, that's a nice little pump right there that you would be seeing in the event that this were to play out. Now, if it takes a little bit longer uh, and it does more like this over here, then you're looking at a play out over a couple of days and that would make it even higher. And to be fair, uh, not to tell you that it's going to happen, but uh, that would lead us to this line right here. So in the event that it were to play out over a shorter time frame uh, and, and kind of, uh, you know, meander itself around over here, then, you know, this is coming out over here closer to that 19 edge. And until that line breaks, then that's the line that we're going to use. Now, uh, there is also this little area right here that uh, either way, we're, we're talking about upward momentum. So there is this little kind of um, paradigm right here where you get this kind of channel formation right here still leads to the upside but again could ha could give us a little bit of that relief after we drop that zero looks like we're in line for about a two to three uh 300 percent increase over a fairly short period of time i want to say so that's what the charts are showing right now but what about news also what about this burnt face like who burns their face in the middle of winter this guy so uh what about what is going on out here for you to follow well, let's talk about that real quick because it involves Ben Armstrong. Ben Armstrong, again, BitBoy Crypto. Um, you know, guys, we've been talking for a long time about what's going on over at uh, Discover Up Crypto. And guess what? There's a gigantic Discover Up that's happening. Uh, you've got uh, uh, Justin Williams. You've got DZ. You've got all the people who are part of Vumeo uh, that are suddenly removing Vumeo from their bios over here suddenly uh justin williams no longer the president of vumeo uh suddenly when we come over here uh vumeo nft he's not it, there's no involvement there uh and dz is also removed uh his stuff from uh, that he was part of vumeo so a little weird stuff going on now remember uh all of these people and friends of ben armstrong made investments into this, and that was part of the shakedown that was happening, alleged shakedown that was happening uh, from Larry, the disabled guy, when all of this stuff was happening. So uh, you got to be asking yourself, is this going to be another in a line of victories that Ben Armstrong is about to go through? I think so, and I think this is going to be positive for the price action of Ben Coin. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. Hit the like button, subscribe button. Remember, it's not financial advice, but I'm always right.